Welcome back, everybody. The Cherry Hills 17 Farming Simulator 17 BC Edition here on Mr. Blue Farms. Woohoo! Folks, today we're going to be doing a little bit of everything. We got to uh, fertilize our crops. We got to pick up some wood. We got to do some uh, grass mowing, making some silage and stuff like that. So sit back, hang on tight, and let's get this beginning, okay? Or rolling, I should say. Uh, let me see what side I'm on. I think it should be the right side right there. And then I'm working on the third trailer back here. As you can see, I already got the very back one loaded. Undo my, undo my straps. Hit B. I think that back one's full enough, hanging off the side a little bit. Got the gray back one pretty much full. So we're going to switch that over to the next one up there. See if they're all there. As you can see, I, I'm getting there, folks. I guess I can say that I'm getting there. Oh, what am I doing? I'm trying to get as close as I can to these. Uh, I don't learn if you stop. It works a heck of a lot better. And uh, hit your B button again. Just look at your F1 settings up there. Uh, before you pull up, just make sure you're stopped before you turn your auto load on. I have to kind of pull up just a tiny bit here and there or hit the auto load button again because it wants to go back to the other mode yeah that other mode but you know what I mean well folks how y'all doing today y'all doing all right now before some of y'all get your panties in a wad this is pre-recorded Sunday night Yes, folks, this is pre-recorded. I'm going to need some more trees. I'm going to go ahead and tarp that and circle back around. As you can see, I have plowed all this. This was our grass field. Got some places I work and missed over there. Uh, worker done all this out here, but I done down through making it straight and done some around the sides. Don't know what I'm going to do with that. I think I'm going to just keep those trees there for a time being. Might thin a few of them out. And as you can see, I got some big trees here. I'm just going to lay them on the trailer somehow or another and haul them that way. One, two, three. I think there's four right there somehow. I got four trailers, one on each trailer. Strap it and haul it that way. It'd be a heck of a lot easier. Uh, well, yeah, you know how we used to do it back in the West Bridge Hills day, back when I first began and started this. But once this thing gets full, folks, you can't drive too fast at all. If I want to uh, hop out here, let me get this uh, junk off of here for right now, that Spectre mod. It's not junk, but I just want to clear up the screen a little bit here. As you can see, 72,000. Yeah, folks, 72,000. But I bought the roller. This is the John Deere tractor, the 7530. I actually thought this was a 70. Oh, yeah, it's 7530. It's up one. Let's get the chip tune. I used a GPS mod to get this straight and keep on out through there. So, yeah, I brought him down from the cows area. 
and I've been using this tractor here to do the plowing. Had the big boy doing the field work out there while I was using this one to plow with. I wish I could keep it straight, but I know I can't. But yeah, I, I don't have to clean up too much more trees. Yeah, it kind of worked over it. But what I'm doing here, this pretty much going to be a straight line out on that roller. Straight out. But I'm still going to cut some more of these trees, probably from where the... Uh... Oh, let me go over here. Right here. I'm going to make a straight shot from the uh, edge of this field. So yeah, show y'all here. Probably do some more of this off screen when I'm in pain with my gums. But I'm gonna cut everything to the right of this tractor down through here. I might get rid of that tree, just kind of open this up. I might take everything out on this side of this lake. Just kind of make it look pretty. Might save one or two trees. Thought I got hung on a tree there. But yeah, just come down through here, kind of open all this up so they'll have room to turn around. I'm not going no further that way from the uh, roller packer down there. So, pretty much be about right here to my left side. And, uh, don't know how far I'm going to go that way. Eventually, I'll probably open all this up. Now, Two is a big size field, folks. But if I open two and 19 up and have that all as one field, yeah, that's going to be a big field. And down there by one, where it makes that little round loop down there by the, the bottom left corner, if I can take all those trees out, that could be a whole lot more farmland. It ain't nothing but flat area down through there, I think. If I take all that out and combine 1, 2, and 19 and square it up. Uh, see, can I have my mouse show y'all here? All this area here, bottom left corner, plow all it, take all the trees out, plow, combine these 1 and 2. Okay, and come even out through here and straight up edge of this two here, straight up and have this over here for the grass and this over here for like wheat, for straw. And that'll take care of our animals. We'll have all the rest of this for farmland. So, uh, yeah. But two probably will be my next field I buy. So, yeah. But anyway, uh, I just want to show y'all what I was doing down here. Just not, we might jump to some more of this here in a minute. I know this is kind of boring to some of y'all. Some of y'all like it. So, uh, yeah, but I got other things to show y'all. But um, let's see here. I'm going to do it this way. I want to show y'all this here first. Now, folks, as you can see here, canola, wheat, sugar beets, corn, barley, soybeans. So that's a little bit of each. Uh, this wheat and the barley will be straw for the cows and pigs and stuff like that. And I do want to get into buying some animals. So I'm going to figure out where the animal place is on this episode, hopefully. Don't hold me to it. That's just a hopefully. So let's go ahead and enter this tractor. And I done fertilized all that over there. I started at the edge of the barley and worked that way. And now I'm working back this way. So I'm just going to go ahead and hire a worker. Make sure he turns around right. Uh, let's see here. I think Junior's going to be on this. 
All right, yeah, he's turning. Good. Uh, we're probably going to clear some of these trees out through here. Not very many, because there's a lot of trees, but we're going to square this end up. Probably take a, give a little and take a little, you know what I mean? Um, let's see, what is that, 28% corn. Uh, got, well, y'all know what I got, you know, it's barley. Corn, sugar beets, wheat, and canola. But I want to show you what I got down here to fill this truck with. with. There's this, this truck here. It got it loaded with fertilized. And I've just been trying to keep them you know, pulled up every other round. So, and uh, yeah. And I want to come on back over here. And I know I ain't doing very much farm work. Well, I'm working on that, folks. We got to get things fertilized. Um, I bought something in advance, which I didn't want to buy it right now, but let's figure out what. I've been having problems with this guy here. He'll run for a little bit and stop. See what is it? R? For automatic filling. I didn't know we could do that. Cool. Um, there we go. Uh, disable pallet. Nope. Turn off. No, nope, don't want to do that. See, it's, the, it's just not working. I don't know what I got. Because that should be off there, and that's off. They don't have the automatic. Oh, there it is. See? I can't get it to do that. Now, when I first. Now, it's got. It's filled up with seeds. 16,000 seeds. Uh, I've been having uh, the manual start edition on so it will stay running. Then, when you first start the game, it put pallets out. Because look, it, it put pallets out. See? It made uh, four because I had two on here already. But I think we got plenty. I'm going to show y'all right here. Let's see. Yeah, I'm going to uh, Those over there are fertilized. And, folks, these right here are seeds. And, see. Put my little thing down here. There, yeah, as close as I can right here. Um, there we go. Ah, off the pole. And there we go. That's not but seeds right there, so that should hold us a little bit. Uh, just fill the fertilizer up on this thing. Uh, yep, yeah, see? 30,000 what it holds there. Here, 11,608 left in here, plus 16 there, so every time I start episode, I'll run it for till it stops. And I guess I'll park this truck right here. Pretty much just kind of showing you what I've done because I've done quite a bit of stuff off screen. And yes, folks, it's getting a little laggy here and there. Uh, we got the four trailers there. I need to haul some more grain and stuff. Uh, corn planter, which we didn't use. Probably end up, need to sell it. The all around cultivator. Uh, This head here we can probably sell. That head, the corn planter, this corn head, we need to sell along with that fertilized, that liquid fertilized thing when they get empty. And probably that planter there. 
you know, like, why are you selling everything, Mr. Blue? Well, folks, we got to make room for the new equipment. And what are they going to do with the planter? There's our one combine there. I did buy another combine. I'm going to show you that here in just a little bit. And we do have that green trailer, which, uh, really don't know what we can use it for. I got to get our plows cleaned up. Uh, folks, I think we're going to go ahead and keep this tractor. It's the 9630. Uh, looks decent. Runs pretty decent. So, yeah. It's going to be pulling the big planter. Uh, we can probably sell that too. Won't need it. This baby needs a bath. Now, I was talking uh, yesterday on Giants Island 17 that I wish somebody would take this bell, this baler right here and it would be nice with a Mr. Blue logo right there and it would wrap uh, maybe I don't know I would like to have pink wrap with the, my Mr. Blue logo on it I think that would look so nice but I'm going to keep that this baler and I'm going to get another baler I don't know, we got that, but I want to get the chrome uh, baler to, to match that. Now, I am puzzled. Let's see. There's our tater down there. Let me find this planter real quick. I think I parked it up here on the front lot. Yeah, because there's a tractor. We're getting rid of this tractor because uh, it's this. I, I don't know, folks. It's just not doing right to me. There's our planner. We're going to get another one of these babies. Because I love this guy. They're wide and covered some ground, folks. And we got some straw in there. Uh, here's our bales. See? Right here on this bale. Right here in the center. Have a Mr. Blue logo. That would look so neat. But have a pink wrap. Because I want to support the puppies. The puppies? What are you talking about, Mr. Blue? The puppies? Yeah, folks, the puppies. Uh, 55% waste. And looks like I need to get some fuel down here for this thing for it to start working. Uh, I do have the one up by biogas. Oh, I thought I feel that. One by biogas is working. What is this over here? Is this... I don't know. I know it's like a slurry tank or something. Maybe it's a uh, fuel station to store it. Because I don't think this thing here makes slurry. But folks, I think that's about it as far as showing y'all stuff. 150,000? Yeah, Give me those. Uh, I need some more grass. That's coming up in future videos. We gotta get that field down first, planted. Um, already got planted down there, so don't worry about that. Here's our pig food. Zero, folks. We need to get uh, potatoes, sunflowers, and corn. That's pretty simple. I like it when they can do it like that. But you can use other stuff, uh, corn, wheat, barley. Uh, corn's supposed to be here over sunflowers. I don't know why they done that like that. But this is our solids maker. And I almost maxed out both, both products. But yeah, I'm going to get rid of that track. And I, I think I'm going to do it right now. I'm just going to direct sell it, go to the garage. Bro, 
gonna be way on over here. Is uh, I'd like to get another grain cart. And here's the auto load bait, uh, bail spike, auto load bail spike. It works excellent, folks. Uh, I need to show that to y'all. Is that it? But this is a uh... oh okay. This is the regular head. This is a corn head for this combine. And it all says New Holland. But uh, we gotta check that out here in a minute. I forgot the number on that tractor. Ain't that bad? Ninety five sixty R. 9560R. Sorry, folks. 9560R. R. 9560R. I hope that's it. Sale. Yes. Yay, I got the right one. Good. All right, without wasting any time, let's go ahead and show y'all. Not the train. But this. Yes, folks, this is our new, newest toy. That's it, unfolded. Oh, well, Mr. Blue looks just like a new hop. Wait a minute. Yes, folks, it, it looks like it's a bad paint job when you look at the sides in a way a certain angle you know like that it like it's been bondoed or something but I don't know but it's John Deere CR 1090 John Deere and the New Holland with the John Deere logo in it I guess John Deere bought it or something I don't know But it's got all the pretty lights, just like the John Deere. I mean, just like the New Holland. Uh, both of the headers are good size. It's a complete package. You're probably going to be seeing another one of these. We might sell the uh, the other one we got, the yellow one, and get these. Depending on how this one does. So, yeah. I like it, folks. I can't wait to use it. But anyway, that's that. And yeah. I'll use the course play to get it down there here in a minute. Uh, big buds down here. Sit up and ready for the potatoes. I mean, the sugar beets. We're going to load to get this full first. Yeah. And this guy here, I, I just I like his tractor for some reason. I really do. I'm going to move over, get this plow, run over some things. Come on now. Now, I don't like what that does on that, so this one probably won't be on the plows. But yeah, I just want to move that out of the way. But if they get dirty fast, folks, they really do. Put him over here out of the lean tube. This goes we can. And of course, we need to get this guy home too. And nothing, of course, play can't handle. Um, yeah, like I said, you know, I'm working on that. We might work on that here in a minute. I'm trying to, yeah, uh, let's get this off. There we go. Where did our buddy go? Where did he stop at? Are you still going? 
they're still going. He should be needing some fertilizer by now. Yeah, I'm going to put it back on here and see if I can see it. Well, I'm trying to see it. He's still going. What tractor is that? I think it's a T8. He's into the sugar beets now, it looks like. Yeah, right, chase him. Ah. Well, he ain't used hardly any. Well, he used about 8,000 because this thing holds 50, I believe. Uh, the trailer for it, folks, is under this in here. Has that third one, and the other part. I don't know why they're separated so bad for, but it's in this part. And let's check see how much that's going to hold real quick. Uh, yep, fifty thousand, forty-two meters spread. So right now, eight thousand what it used. I don't want to. I'm a hired worker, that's why I can't open it. But yeah, that's our corn and barley that's done been fertilized and working on the sugar beets. Smell my feet, give me something good to eat. Let's go to our map real quick and see what we're looking like on the fertilization. I'm going to have to go around the edges. You can see from here up and around, I went around the edges. So, yeah. But we got half that field and one to go. So, basically, folks, we need to work on 19. So we can fast forward time. So, he's doing a good job here. Got a little ways to go. That heals what's what's getting them. Let's see if I can shorten this up a little bit. There we go. That's what I like. It helps me out better. Tractor crawler, so that's what it is. Okay. So uh, yeah, we need to work on this. Work on that. Work on this. 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 That. I just like doing that, it kind of helps me find the stumps uh, a whole lot faster. So I'm going to do that and then we're going right here. I'm on auto save. Okay. You're a little laggy down here. We should be getting some more money here pretty soon, folks. It's getting out to the end there. And um, you can see all these logs I got here. I have changed the forks out. Uh, I'm going to bring some more logs down here and stack them up on the other side there. And I got room out in the middle here, but I really don't want to put that many logs at a time. So yeah, okay, this is what I was thinking. Uh, and I did bring some fertilizer down here for that seed master. I just need to bring some grain. So. Uh, 
let's get this course uh, cruise. Yeah, course play. Yeah, course plays. Course play. God. Can't talk. There we go. Grinding some stumps. Let's see. Yeah, pretty much straight on this line, so. Let's take uh, about two or three tractors half wide. Uh, actually, I just got a couple down through here to do. And I should be able to use the roller then. And, oh, so I'll come back and get that right there. But ain't no big. That's a big one. Left too much on that. Oh, check it out. Good, 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 good. But, uh, yeah, folks, um, like I said earlier, this is pre recorded. It was recorded Sunday night. And, uh, I've done that because, uh, them pulling my teeth out. I want to make sure I didn't stop the videos for y'all. I want to make sure y'all had something to watch each day. Uh, I got some vlog footage I need to get up and done. Right, let's see how far we can go with the rower. And, uh, let's see here. I think everything is still set. Should be. Back up a little bit. Go back forward. Let it down. Zoom out a little bit. Go ahead and set my speed. Oh, 18. Ah, that's flying. Where's that one spot at? Right up there. I want to stop before I get to that. Yep, I'll stop right here. Bring this tractor back down, do that. I should have done it before I even got down there. But now, I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Uh, I can't make it too much wider because they'll detect the other field and stop. a little bit wider over not much but I'm wanting to get the trees over to the pond that way I go up and down which I might not even go that far that's just uh, me thinking if I run the tractors up and down that they'll go out and have enough room to turn around without hitting a tree. Get my thing right there back up. Well, it looks off for some reason, but I guess it's right. Oh, man, it's going. Oh, good, it got it. Sound like signal is on. Like it's done a pretty straight line. And I guess I need to stop for right now. Let's see what I can do right here. Kinda get this squared up a little bit, I guess. That's about all I can do until. Come on, pick up. That's about all we can do until we get the the uh, what you gonna call it down here? What you gonna call it? Okay. Ah, there we go. I'm 
gonna try to get this where I can get it planted. Ooh, 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 ooh. Almost messed up. Turn my satellite tracking back on. I'm just gonna let this run straight on out. Just like that. I guess let's go cut some trees, folks. What is our Junior still working? Boo and Jason's on uh, vacation, folks. So is uh, Colin. Uh, Junior decided to to help me out. So, uh, yeah, you can help me fertilize, so. Got to have my F1 on here. That way I can see when the, my A pops up and I can cut. Just been cutting in regular 8 mil. Um, I think my wood chips is full on the mill at, on the west side on the left side of the map it's full of wood chips and I can't put no more in that and I need to go see if I can take those wood chips and use them for fuel and, or even for compost mix I think all my trucks is filled up as you know, a tipper. And that one truck's got the four trailers, it's going to be used just for the combines and stuff. We're about 38 minutes in. I think I've done about showed y'all everything that I've been doing, except for one thing. I know there's one thing we need to do, and I forgot about it, folks. I am so sorry. Biogas number nine. Fingering on this stretch across here. All right, we need to get this guy here going. I need to dump that trailer there. So let's start him up. Go around these edges right here. But yeah, I love these fraggle, I think that's how you say it, trailers. They can hold 250,000 liters. I know that is extreme. It's better than the 32, what they've been doing. 32,000. Big difference, folks. Well, I'm fixing to put this guy on horseplay to do this field. But I'm going to go and empty, empty this trailer out real quick. Drop the head right there. Drop that back trailer right there. I love the way this new Holland looks and stuff. But the chrome big M, look how sharp that looks. It just, ooh, turns me on. Let's see here. I don't know how much. Um, was just empty. Empty. Uh oh, oh! I just got myself in. run over here real quick. F one. Oh man, we're gonna need some more digestates. 
22,000. Okay. All right. Oh, watch where I'm going. How much compost we got? 124,000 compost. Now, folks, you can come over here and I'll load it in a truck for you. So, I just need to get a truck empty. I'm going to go ahead and dump this. I was going to dump it in a composter. But I'm going to go ahead and dump what I can in here. Because we need more digestate. I guess I could take one of these trailers and run it up there. No more room. Okay. The only thing about it, it's not very much at a time goes in there. I would like to have uh, oh like a, a grass storage thing up here somewhere. Thing about stop, yeah. It. What is that? It and that's it. Why ain't this thing running? Is it out of fuel? Ah, right, come on, until right here. Yeah, it's out of fuel. That's why it's not running. There you go. Alright, we got liquid fertilizer here. And this is the liquid one here. Okay. What am I doing? Drive, Mr. Blue, drive. That's going to take a little bit for that to go down. I need to figure out what's this. Um, uh, straw and liquid manure. Produces manure. So you can take your liquid manure there and straw and it'll make more manure. Wow, okay. What what I'm trying to do folks is uh hang on. My mind's thinking. I do have spots to store grass. Turn grass into silage. Drop silage in there. Oh, yeah, baby. We ain't never tried it, folks, so let's, let's try it. I just wonder how much grass this thing will hold. Not bad. All right, we're gonna go hook our other trailer. I wanna get this guy started. I guess we'll just dump our uh, extra grass over there and probably get a front loader down here now. I didn't think about that. All right, let's see where our starting point is. Uh, 
Is that my wheel? See what trail is there? Scroll six. One and nineteen. No one. Let's see what it looks like. Nope, that's not it. Harvester mo. Uh, delete. That's it right there. Okay, my starting point's right here behind us. And keep from leaving any. I'll go ahead and turn mower on. And it's going to drive up here. Mow about right there. And then I'm going to back up. And then I'm going to say first waypoint drive course. Stop at the last trigger. And there we go. Uh, we'll fill up 500,000 of grass. And they'll notify us when it's done. So, yeah. I need to get this trick off the uh, field. Turn this on, get these stumps out of the way. Don't want to get hung up on. Um, yeah, see how I got sidetracked from the biogas? I need, uh, what I want to do, that's what I want to do. That's what I want to do, that's what I want to do. I want to do it before I forget, folks. Animals. I don't have one one Wilson livestock trailer coming up I yes okay and I need need three of these guys and they're gonna be blue light blue dark blue, dark blue. Uh, with a beacon on them, yeah, might as well, why not? One, two, three. And I need the stations too, but I don't think we'll need anything else. We'll need a water trailer. Um, think about getting him. 32,000. Yeah, we'll, we'll start off with him first. Oh, uh, what's the difference between a standard and a color? Uh, oh, well. Okay, now we need a truck. Um, just gonna scoop this guy over. Third combine. Here's our planner. So I, I need to bring the buffalo down here. Not the buffalo, but the scorpion. I want to take out the trees that's on this side of the fence. Just start right here. See you there. Okay, that one's Walter. I'm going to take out this tree, this tree, this one, this one, this one, and this one. And go ahead and take out these down through here. And maybe just a little bit more. I can probably make one more through. I think. I'm not for sure. Yeah. 
All right, there's our animal trainer. I just need a trip for her. Come on, trip, trip, trip. Uh, uh, let's hang on a second, folks. It won't take this second. See, here's the one with the straw, but... Yeah, it's full. And I know I can't... I'm not supposed to lift this. But I am curious. This is a full stack, 2,000 liters, and I want to sell it. I want to see how much one of these is, real quick. Almost $3,000 for a pallet of lumber, folks. All you gotta do is take straw. That's wood chips. So you use straw or wood chips. Cool. We can pretty much leave this truck up here. And then we'll take care of this. What is it making there? It's making wood chips? And it uses wood chips for fuel. Could that be right? Let me look at this one more time, folks. Okay, something's definitely wrong with the display. Logs that produces burrowed cargo boxes and pallets. Unless they get this way mixed up with this one, because this one here also produces barrels, cargo boxes, and pallets. Oh my, and there's your wood chipper thing. I'll show y'all here, this second here. Yep, so it's got plenty of logs. Let's see, all you gotta do is just pick up. Oh, don't, don't mess up. Pick up this a little bit. Swing it. And voila. So, if you get these loaded with wood, you're going to have money, folks. And see, we still got logs in here. 299,000 logs. And 150,000 wood chips. You can see right there, wood chips, 150,000. 100% full, 99% full of logs. That's, I believe, is fuel for this thing over here. So as soon as that straw runs out, we got wood chips to last for the blue coos. It's easy money right here. All you gotta do is bring trees here. Drop them there, drop in the wood chipper. So, yeah. Let's see what truck I can bring up. Um, I have to get some. Ah, what am I looking for? Uh, number four. We'll use this truck right here. The reason I'm wanting it because it's short instead of long like the others and that will help out folks got about five minutes left I was wanting to get into the animals folks but it's almost time to go I don't want to go over the hour am I going the right way Yes, I am. Alright, what I'm going to do... Um, where in the world is an animal place? Uh, 
bam! Looking at the map, I looked up and too late. Alright, uh, here's the market shop. I need to buy one more of these trucks. Oh my god, I'm so bad. This truck is so fast and stuff. But, yep. Shift that up just a little. And, folks. Well, which one I'm getting in. There I go. Is this the right B? And what is it? Left and right on uh, the right B. Holding it down, do left and right. And then open that up. So, whoa, I'm gonna close. And uh, just put it in front of your three point hitch here. Jump in the truck. And voila! Gets to carry something extra. I don't know if this got a hitch on the back of it or not. Nope. Can't double transport. Okay. But anyway, it's pretty good though. Uh, gotta zoom in. I think the animals are up here. Milk sales. Bills. Fuel cell, spinner, five mil, manure cell, compost cells, surrey cells, barn two, I don't see it folks, tell you what, I'm going to go up, Go through all of our equipment. Oh, I'm glad that goes fast. I'm just holding the button now. Sit. One. Oh, 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 oh. I think I seen it. Nursery. Tree nursery. Well, there's a lot of place for slurrians and stuff. Uh-oh. Cow pasture. Animal dealer. Yay! Wait, what? A sale place way out there, really. Anyway, animal dealer. We'll visit. Where's it at? Oh, man. Oh, I ain't too far. That's close to the shop. Okay. Alright, folks. I'm on a Get off here because I'm at my iron mark. But uh, when we come back, y'all going to see some animals. I'm going to head down there and get this thing full. What I'm going to do, I'm going to fill this trailer up with each animal until I run out of money. And I need that map back on. Let's see. Up here and go back out like I'm going to back to the shop. Yep. Whoa. Watch the road down the map. 
All right, folks. Like I said, next time y'all come on, we're going to have a load of each animal. And, yeah, we'll go from there. Our guy's still mowing grass up there. Good. We're going to need all that we can get with the cows and stuff. But, uh, yeah, folks, I just want to say thank you for watching and stuff. Uh, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Y'all know the routine. And head on over to uh, Colin Julian. Uh, and let's try to get him to earn 50 subs. And if I get 50 people say that they uh, came from my channel and went to his to, to subscribe, you know, they'll say I sent you over to subscribe. If I get 50 people to do that, I will drive up to Colin's house, hand him a pie to throw in my face. Okay? All right. Uh, word for today is cow. Cow. I need to start putting that in the, like the middle of the episode or three quarters way through. But uh, word for today is cow. C O W cow. Watch this one. We'll Take that car off. <laughs> anyway, folks, gotta get off here. Whoa, this is a tight area. Ooh. Ooh, folks. We'll bring some grass up here and dump it and get more fuel and fertilizer. All right, awesome. Anyway, bye, folks. Love y'all. Y'all have a good day, a blessed day. And, uh, yeah. Let's show some love. Bye.